Hey YouTube, American Woman RV here, Maxine, and I am in Arizona at the Buckskin Mountain State Park near Parker, Arizona. I thought I'd give you a tour, show you what's here if you're interested in coming out this way at all. Welcome to the Cactus Garden and Desert Tortoise Habitat. Let's see what they have. And old tools. So there's something. And this is a sweet acacia tree. Oh, is it pretty? Look at that. It's very nice. And it's November. 15th, 2023 today. These are aloes. And uh, I think that's an ocotillo. Which will bloom, I think, red flowers. This is a prickly pear. Mmm. Look the size of this cigarro. This is cow's tongue, I guess. Look at these cacti. Tall, very tall. Barrel cacti. And we're right along the Colorado River. It's a really nice, quiet park. Calico cactus. Hedgehog cactus. This one doesn't say what it is. That one looks really prickly. Wow, I'd hate to fall in that. If you want to read it, you can pause it. These are from the Sonoran Mojave Deserts. There's four des deserts in the southwest. And that's two of them. Okay. This is along the river. There's RVs across the way. Colorado River. Desert tortoises are threatened. I'm assuming there's a desert tortoise in here. I just don't happen to see one. I don't see any tortoise. Unless he's on the other side. Take a quick look. I don't think he's here. Unless he's in the house. There's a little house down there. But I don't see anybody. I don't see anything. No water, no food. Let me walk along the river here. Near the garden. interesting plant right here. And here's where we are. And it's part of the 
Well, I believe. Anyway, this is a little garden they have attached to the park. This must be the seeds. Those green things. So this is what you can do if you come to this park. This to RV or camp out. They also have day use, but probably need to live in the area. This is a honey mesquite tree. Looks like it caught fire, but I don't know if that's natural. It's so black. Yeah. And then over here, Desert Holly. That's quite pretty. And there's the entrance to the park where you pay. It was $40 a night for water and electric. And that's a Tuesday night. Look at the size of this one. It's huge. That's extremely old. Okay. Yes, I'm out here meeting with other people that own the same kind of vehicle that I own, a Volkswagen Rialto. It's kind of like a classic. And so we're doing a meetup. So, this is where we're meeting up. There's some old wagon wheels. Let's take a look at those. And then, do the park. A little bit at the park, I'll show you. It has swimming. It has a boat launch. So you can launch your boat. I don't know what this is. But here's some old... This is how you drive in. So stay tuned. So this is the park, and I guess you can tent camp here. It's a state park, Arizona State Park, and here's my rig. I still have my Volkswagen Rialta. And there's quite a few of us. Yeah. Looks like Rialtas had babies there, because there's a lot of Rialtas. Here's my rig. There's the restroom, showers, and uh, it's a very nice place. It goes all the way along the Colorado River. I'll show you the bathroom in a second. Okay, this is the bathroom area. There's a sink, and then in here is the women's restroom. what it looks like. Toilets. Not, at least they're not those silver ones that are ice cold. And here's the shower. This one's a shower also. I haven't tried the shower yet. Anyhow, this is basically what the bathrooms look like. They're open 24 hours. Stay tuned for more. So this is the RV park, and I guess you can have tents here, too. And then over here is the road. And this is my rig right here, the Rialta. There's a bathroom right there with showers, which I'll show you in a little bit. Then they have these 
little grassy areas over here. Some of the spots are shaded and some of them are in the sun. So in the summer, you probably want to get a shaded spot. There's more bathrooms down there. Stay tuned. So from the bathrooms here, they have all this closed off. I guess they're working on fixing it up. And then there's another set of bathrooms down here. And this goes all the way around the lake. The river. I mean, the river goes all the way around it. The park. So stay tuned. So here are some more of the sites under the trees. That's what the sites look like. They're pretty big. So, over there is the river. So that, this is directly across the river. Some little place it looks like for the people that are over there. And then this is part of the campground. If you keep walking this way, there's a beach and a boat launch. It's cloudy out there. Stay tuned. So over here must be the dump station where you can dump because the spots only have electric and water. There's a few of them that have the full hookups, but this is for dumping your rig. Drinking water's over there. Then they have this game area, which is, I don't know, there's several different games that you can play here. Outdoor yard games, I'd call them. Cornhole. I think that's what they call one of them. And there's a boat that doesn't move. But it is where you boat, launch the boat. The foot noise is because of all the gravel. Sorry. And that's where you launch your boat. So, it's another view, the RV park. It goes all the way over there. They also have hiking trails. So, I hope you had a good uh, view of this, and I'll see you on the next one. It's been a while since I've been out. Take care, everybody. Have a great day. Bye.